Hey, it's Danny from Cotch's Calisthenics here. So I thought I'd show you what I eat in a day whilst I'm in Chiang Mai, Thailand, which I've moved to recently. So I woke up around half five, done some work online, some Instagram posts, connected with some people, it's really good. Started off with some hydration. This is water that's been reverse osmosis, UV'd and ozonated. It's one of the purest waters that you can buy, which is absolutely amazing. It's around 7 a.m. now and I'm gonna go out to make some videos. And then later on I eat because yeah, I eat a minute and fast daily and who knows how long I'll fast for today. Maybe around 18 hours or 20 hours. We should see how I feel. So we're gonna buy some of these to eat these in a while. These are red dragon fruit on the inside and these ones are white. These ones are so much sweet and they're in season and they're a very good price as well. So I look forward to eating them shortly. So if you're into fruit, Moon Mai Market in Chiang Mai is one of the best places to come. There is just an absolute abundance of fruit everywhere. Pineapples, all types of melons, more pineapples. And look what we have behind me here, the world's smelliest fruit known as durian, or the king of fruits. Do you even love it or you hate it? The first thing I'm gonna consume is some water from a young Thai coconut. Brilliant way to get my digestion going and not get it to start off with anything heavy. Oh, that is so sweet, like wow. Man, these are in season at the moment, so they're really high quality and it's cold as well, not too cold, but I'm really hot, so it's perfect. Oh. Man, if you've not been into Thailand, come here and try things like lovely fresh local Thai coconuts and lovely fresh fruit. <laughs> balance of these red dragon fruit and that's going to be my next meal and I have no idea how many you're going to eat I just eat until my body said no more I'm very good at being in tune my body out of an intuitive eater this is why I do not calorie restrict so yeah I'm going to feast on these and yeah these are one of the sweetest fruits in the world that you can buy absolutely amazing and you wait to see the vibrant color inside it's mind-blowing Hours later. Three, and now we are done. So yeah, let's get a move on. Here we have what is known as the banana hanger, and I think you can see why, because there is just an absolute abundance of bananas everywhere. So I'm now back home, and I thought I'd show you everything I got: so the mangoes, Holland papayas, apple bananas, the smaller ones, Cavendish bananas and the red dragon fruit and this will come to about 510 baht i'm going to put the conversion down for usd but most of these fruits in season so it's very very cheap except for the mango so yeah i'm going to get on with some work quickly and then i'm going to make a protein smoothie so i'm now going to make a simple protein smoothie this is my backup protein powder i normally use garden of life's one this is pea protein and quinoa protein and it's got an enzyme blend in there to really help easily digest it and stop the phytates binding to a lot of the nutrients specifically the minerals because phytates bind to minerals within the intestinal tract stop you absorbing them so this will help you break them down and absorb them it's usda organic certified it's all vegan soy free no crap added to it whatsoever so yeah what i'm gonna do is get these ripe bananas protein powder water down Cheers. So this is a lot smaller than what I'd normally eat. It normally be double the size, but I need to go and train soon, so I want to digest it a lot faster, so having a small amount would work perfectly. And yeah, I prefer that the water was cold, because this is slightly warm now, but oh well. I've been in a bit of a rush. Making a What I Eat In A Day video and making two other videos earlier and editing them, which they're uploading now, delays your everyday life. Well, the day that you're recording, should I say. So yeah, I'm gonna get on and smash this down. Do a little bit of work and then go out.
also went to go gym and I did an ab workout and my friend here joined me. We did a bit of training, we did a little bit of video together, burpees with pull ups, so yeah that was pretty cool. Had this coconut water from 7 Eleven and yeah we are now at Reform Cafe that apparently does one of the best burgers. So yeah, let's see what they've got. Best we got, I'm gonna take a scoop of creatine and L-glutamine as well. Creatine's good for ATP, increasing your energy, help with recovery time, increase muscle mass, L-glutamine. About 60% of your muscles are made up from glutamine. Brilliant for recovery, again, pretty increasing energy levels, so they work synergistically alongside each other. And yeah, they don't taste too bad. Yeah, so we're all at Reform Cafe. Most people have got burgers, as you can see. Burgers, 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 burgers. Looking good, man. Looking good. And yeah, my friend here's got a salad, and I'm not sure what this is. Pisto. Where's it? Pisto bruschetta. And what's the other thing you got? Nice. And I got a massive man curry there. Bryce burger that has mayo in and those greens I think the burgers made from beans and beetroot maybe like mushroom mushroom mm. and my friend's got one as well how's it ma'am good i'm already picking your part yeah <laughs> we've got some ketchup there as well who doesn't like ketchup Let's try the vegan mayo shall we with the mm. well wow that tastes like actual real dairy mayo mm. It hasn't been super super fried either, not very very oily, a little bit oily, but not over the top, which is really really good. Now for the burger, how do you get this in your mouth? It's time to be more happy than that. Super flavorful, super tasty, wow. It actually does look like a beef burger. And that's just like tastes like one as well. Man, you don't need to like worry about missing out on non-vegan food when you can have vegan food like this. Like, why do you need it? Yeah, we've got the massive man curry here. I'll just try some. Very thick, rich sauce. Never had a massive man curry like it. Loads of potato, unlike a lot of places I've got inside, I can't give you any potatoes, so yeah, very high carb and very tasty, so yeah, thumbs up. Cheers, man. Mm. Finished all the food, and yeah, I wasn't going to eat any more because I'm quite poor, but yeah, I want something sweet, so we've got some coconut, vanilla, ice cream, just to fill it up, so yeah, because we need to be bulky, so yeah, so yeah, I'm going to enjoy this, and yeah, catch you later, peace. Brain freeze. So that was an amazing time out at the restaurant with amazing new people and some people that I already knew. Very grateful that, yeah, one of my friends contacted me and said, do you want to go out to the restaurant? Do you want to choose because you're new here and I invite loads of people? So that worked out perfectly. And yeah, the day was just very, very amazing. So yeah, I'm feeling very happy and very fulfilled and very joyful. So yeah, I broke my fast at around 1.45, stopped eating around 6.45, so today was a five hour window. I hope you all enjoyed the video and seeing what I've eaten in a day. If you have any tips for me for improving my what I eat in a day video and vlog videos, let me know down below because I'm still relatively new to making these type of videos, so I'm doing my best to improve, so if anyone can help me with that, then I'm more than happy to take on board what they have to share with me. And if you have any questions for me, leave them down below. I love answering your questions. And if you like the video, like it down below, give us a thumbs up, and please share this video with anyone that you think might want to see what an intermittent fasting vegan eats within a day that does not calorie restrict to stay super lean and shredded all year round. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and make sure you click the bell notification button next to the subscribe button, otherwise you will not be notified of when new videos are posted. And I have so many types of videos coming on a regular basis showing you what I eat in a day, what I do in a day, the type of training that I do. I have many workout videos coming that are based on calisthenics training and also talking a lot about intermittent fasting and how you can get it to work the best for you to lose weight very rapidly and gain muscle at the same time. So if those videos sound good to you, make sure you do hit that subscribe button now. So as always, stay lean, stay energetic, and go and get those gains. Peace.